In the Medical Radiologic Technology Program at State Tech, we train students how to take x-rays, take care of patients, and prepare them for the national certification exam after they graduate. We have a great balance between lecture and lab time. The students spend some time in the classroom taking notes, listening to lectures, and then they transition into the lab where they can actually put what they've learned from the books into a hands-on experience in the lab, and then they can take that even further, take what they've learned in the classroom and the lab, and apply that in the clinical setting. We actually learn the material here. We actually apply it in the lab. And then once we are ready, our second year, we can actually apply for a student tech job and then get paid for what we do, but actually learn a lot more and build some more confidence. And then once we graduate, we're gonna have that confidence and those skills we learn and that's gonna help us out in the, in the hospital or the real world. We learn the section in class and then we do our packets, we learn everything, and then we have to come in here and pass a actual test in here, Vicki grades you our teacher, she grades you and you have to pass that test or you can, until you can go into clinicals and do it there. So they reduce it down to the two years, you don't have to go the full four years and you get into the field a lot faster. The ideal student for the MRT program is somebody who has great communication skills, both verbal and written. Um, they're interested in patient care. They can show compassion. They also have an aptitude for uh, the sciences, um, anatomy, physiology. We do math as well. After graduation, our students are able to find employment uh, very easily in this area. Employers are actively seeking our state tech graduates. We uh, do a great job at preparing them for employment uh, after graduation.